Well, hi guys, once again. You might remember a year or so back I created a video on non-slip help around the kitchen. So this breadboard, as you can see, is now non-slip. We have this non-slip material cut out to size to place under the board and no matter how hard you push, it won't move. Check it out. If you missed those videos, you can click here and follow the link. It'll pause this video and open up the new one for you. So I'm in Malaysia right now and I don't have access to build one of those. So when I grab my knife and margarine to spread it on the bread on my board, it tends to slip all over the place. And with my hand the way it is, it becomes very difficult to get the job done. So my solution to this is by laying another piece of non-stick mat on top of the board, it becomes a double non-stick surface. So when spreading the margarine now, the bread has a better chance of staying put without the use of the other hand. Now, as the knife is straight, I don't have a downward force, just a sideways force. So my solution is to use a dessert spoon. By scraping the margarine onto the back of the spoon and then onto the bread, you'll get both the downwards force and a sideways motion happening, and it holds the slice a bit better in place. Let's try another one. And bingo. Now for the peanut butter. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I scoop it out with a knife, although the spoon will still work in this situation just by placing it on the back of the spoon. So now the peanut butter is on the bread, I can use the spoon to spread it across the sandwich. So there we have it. It certainly helps on that non-slip surface, especially when you have the use of only one hand. So guys, thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next video. Bye for now.